MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. A good one on tap for you this afternoon between the New York Mets and the Philadelphia Phillies. Stepping in, Ahmed Rosario. He will lead this one off today. Here's the first pitch to him. Didn't quite catch the zone there, ball one. Checks his swing, but this pitch is right there for strike one. The 1-1 one, one home. It swung on and missed for strike number two. Forecast high calls for 80 degrees, but we're at 76 here at opening pitch. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first and no swing. It's ball two. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a liner. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is aboard. Batting second. The second base hit. Number six. So here's Jeff McNeil. Pulled toward right center field. Under it is Harper, and Bryce has got it for the first down. Up next, the power bat of Pete Alonzo. First swings for him in this one, with a runner still at first and one gone. And that misses for ball one. And he misses low with it, 2-0. and Clearly working the bottom of the zone, trying to get a ground ball for a double play. Now a hard liner, but foul. The 2 1. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. Swing and a miss. Looked like the knuckle curved there, and that's out number two. So the runner at first here with two gone in the inning. And up next, the left-handed hitting Michael Conforto is put in play to the right side of the infield. Rosario, the runner at first with two gone. Hit high and deep to right center. On the move is Harper. He gets there to make the play, and that ends the inning. see the leadoff man Andrew McCutcheon as he'll start us out in the home the first. For the Philly, Here it comes. Andrew. At the mark. Yeah. Called strike at the knees. Evens the count at one and one. Your eyes light up from the offensive side playing in a hitter's park like this. Have to get the ball up to do some damage. I'm not mad at that take. Count is one and two now. Now here it comes. McCutcheon will spin and yank this one down the left field line, but this will find the seats foul. Another one-two delivery. Swing and a little blooper to center. Coming in is Nimmo. He can't get there as it falls in. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Into the box now, JT Realmuto, as he swings and misses at a first pitch fastball, 0 and 1. Realmuto behind with an 0 and 2 count now. Let's get it going, boys. Somebody's loose, hitting 98 with ease in the first inning. Not in front of that one, but he stays alive and will do it again on 0-2. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball, but the pitcher went to breaking ball, and the hitter just fouls that one off. And a good curveball there, but he wouldn't bite. It's 1-2. and two. He didn't look overly fooled right there because a lot of pitchers will go to the breaking stuff 0-2, but he certainly looked ready for a breaker on that pitch. A runner at second, nobody out. 
This one's blooped out toward right center field. Here comes the right fielder. Oh, and he can't come up with it. Next to dig in will be Bryce Harper. Harper swings and hits it very well to right. Right fielder looking up. And this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. Next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. As the changeup to him drops in there for the first strike. One ball and one strike to the Phillies' first baseman. Here's the one and one delivery. Hey, after that extra base hit, things could go awry. He didn't. He battled right back in the zone with a nice executed pitch. Fastball called, strike three, and there's the first out of the inning. Digging in, Didi Gregorius. Yes, he'll get his first opportunity in this one. And they start him with one high and away for ball one. This one's outside, quite a bit off the plate that time. Three runs already home here. Didi swings and belts a ball to right field. This is carrying well. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. To the plate now, Luke Boyd. As he chops it on the ground toward the right side, Davis grabs it cleanly. In time to first, and there are two away. Now at the plate, Gene Segura looking to get on base and keep this first inning alive. The pitch. Breaking ball below the zone. That's ball one. As a manager, when you see a guy struggling like this in the first inning, your mind starts racing trying to figure out about how long you're going to go with this guy and how many guys you might end up having to use out of your bullpen just to get through this thing. Not a good spot to be in. Hit the target, but this is low, two and one. Well, I think he just kind of lost focus on the mound right there. It, it's clearly not going his way, and he's thinking more about that than the task at hand. And right now, he needs to think about this hitter. Started to go. Did he hold up in time? Yes, says the first base umpire. It's ball three now. Now the three and two pitch. He swung on and missed strike three. So striding forward now, Wilson Ramos. And they've got some work to do early on. Down 4 nothing already. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on. But you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle. And one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Harper is there, and he has it for the first down. So one away here with the bases empty. And that'll bring up Robinson Cano. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. 0-2 oh now as Cano comes up empty on that one. Check swing, but he held up in time. Ball one. Great job to keep your hands back and not fully commit. The body was out in front on a great changeup right there, but he was able and strong enough to keep his hands back. And he'll step on first for the out, three unassisted. Next up from New York, Joanna Cespedes. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Swung on and missed its 0-1. Man, that pitch had the look of a fastball. Straight changeup, and the bottom fell out of it. Takes this the other way to right. Williams is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Last half of the second set to go, and digging in at the plate, the Texas native Nick Williams. No balls in one strike. The 
the windup and the 0-1. Nope. That misses downstairs for a ball one and one. Boy, that's one of the toughest pitches to lay off. A hard breaking ball at the back foot. Tough take on a terrific pitch. Two and one the count. Now here's the pitch. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Fouled away. The 2-2. Two -two. You do not want to walk the eight-hole hitter. It just opens up so many options. Do we bunt him over to second with the nine-hole hitter? Do we try and play for that big rally with the top of the order coming up? This is a huge pitch. You can't allow this guy to walk. Cespedes is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first down. The third baseman. Striding into the box, Scott Kingery. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. One out, nobody on. And a good idea to hold off on that swing. It's ball one. If he doesn't shorten his swing up right there, there's no chance he keeps his bat back. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Here's the pitch. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. This is skied into short left center. Here comes Cespedes. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. So the next hitter to dig in will be Andrew McCutcheon. He scored a run after stroking a double in his first at bat. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an A-B, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. A ball and a strike to the Phillies' leadoff man. The 1-1. He's in there for strike number two. Hey, I got to really commend this pitcher right here. Was able to regroup in between innings. Something happened in the dugout because he's on point coming out for the second. Neither guy willing to give in, and the at bat will continue. The next one-two pitch. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. After it is Cespedes. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Coming to the plate now, J.D. Davis. He'll begin things here against Aaron Nola. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Skied into straightaway right. Williams is there, one away. That's now at the plate, Brandon Nimmo. Number nine. Ready to deliver, Brandon here's the first pitch. Nimmo. And he throws the fastball by oh, him here, 0-1. Oh, Boy, this guy's got it going on right now. He's executing everything. He should feel pretty good. He's retired seven in a row. Behind 0-2 oh, now. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. And here's a changeup in there for a called third strike, and that's the second out of the inning. The batter, number one. So it's back to the top of the order now, and up next will be the shortstop, Ahmed Rosario. And it's fouled away. Bases are empty here with two men out. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. I know this guy has a lot of weapons on the mound, but what makes him so successful is that he's aggressive in the zone, getting ahead, forcing action. Just off the outside as he can't catch the corner. Fouled off. Another 2-2 offering. A swing and a miss on a ball way outside the strike zone and the 
ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now it'll be the catcher, JT Realmuto. Check swing, cold strike, 0 and 1. Starts to go around here, but it doesn't matter. This is strike two anyway. When I see guys check swinging, they're, they're not seeing the baseball. They're not picking it up. you got to take a step back. The only thing you tell yourself in this situation is do not move your head. And that's out number one. Now that better so one gone here in the Philadelphia five. third. And that will bring in a dangerous hitter indeed in the form of Bryce Harper. And here's a slider that's nowhere close, and it's 1-0. 2-0 to the Philly center fielder. I wonder if that homer rattled him a little bit. He's certainly a little bit more cautious against him this time around. Smoke toward the hole. Reined in. On to first, and there were two down. So bases are empty here with two gone, and that'll bring up Reese Hoskins. Halfway to 100 pitches, here it is. Line to the right side but foul now here it comes two out nobody on swung on and missed and that's the final out of the inning. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Jeff McNeil. Number six. Hit in the air to straightaway center. Harper has a read on it, makes the play one away. So the bases are empty with one man gone, and up steps the power bat of Pete Alonso. Oh, had him chopping at that one. It's nothing in one. Not shocked by their aggressive nature at the plate today, but they got to change their M.O. if they're going to compete in this one. A ball and a strike to the Mets first baseman. Popped him up. Segura over to his right. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Now in the box, Michael Conforto. He flew out in his last at bat. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB. No runs, just one hit, and no errors on the Mets line score so far. Conforto behind the ball in two strikes. High in the air and deep down the line in left. And he will get there to make the running play. And trying to pick things up where he left off. Didi Gregorius. He got a hold of one and went yard in his first appearance in this one. And he takes ball one. Well, it's been a rough one so far. Four runs through three innings. It's about time to get that pitch count down or he won't be out here very long. Chopped toward the second baseman. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Now back. The Stepping up to the plate, Luke Voigt. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Fastball well outside. Four runs, four hits, and no errors on the ledger for the Phillies to this point. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. But it bends just foul into the second deck. Ready with the 1-1 one, one pitch. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. He's around first, heading for two. And he's in there easily at second with a one-out double. The batter, number two. And that'll bring up Gene Segura as he grounds one briskly to short. Rosario's got it the tag and they got him as he couldn't get back to second the right fielder, number five. up next will be Nick Williams as the first pitch to him is a changeup that can't find the zone it's ball one 0 for 1 for him here in this one 
And this is a fastball that's right on the black but ruled a ball. It's 2 0 now. This offense is absolutely feasting on these count leverage situations. If he's going to have any chance of feeling good about his effort tonight, this pitcher has got to get back in the strike zone. The third baseman, number four. And in steps Kingery. Scott Kingery. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Rosario's got it cleanly. Throw on to first is in time, and the Phillies are turned away. They get nothing out of this situation as the inning is over. All set for the start of the inning, and next is the catcher, Wilson Ramos. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going, and the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the eighth and ninth inning. Count now a ball and a strike. One and one, here it comes. Two balls, one strike, the count. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Great A-B up until this point. A walk right here could really just infuse some confidence into this lineup. Full count, three and two. And he fouls this one off. The next three, two. And a good eye here as he takes ball four, and it's a base on balls to lead off the fifth inning. So Robinson Cano will grab a bat next. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Now a fastball a bit too low here. It's ball 1. This is skied into short left center. McCutcheon is under it. One out. So here's Joanna Cespedes. Hit it hard, but lined out in his first at bat. From the belt, the pitch. Everything this guy throws moves. And that two seamer has a mind of its own. One and zero pitch on the way. Swing and a miss. One and one. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that front foot down early and get ready, or he's going to throw it right by you. Uh, fooled him badly there. I mean badly. It's one and two. From the belt, the pitch. Swing and a miss. Looked like the knuckle curved there, and that's out number two. Now, back. now with the plate, J.D. Davis. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. From the stretch. Nope, that's inside. Davis takes the swings from the right handed batter's box but he's one of those rare hitters that actually thrives facing same handed pitching one of the very best in the game as a matter of fact in that type of matchup yeah Matty he does not leak with that front side he keeps that shoulder tucked stays inside the baseball and it gives him every opportunity to hammer the fastball and stay on that breaking stuff here now the 2 2 gets him looking at the knees for the strikeout. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now as we move past the halfway point in this one and begin the bottom of the fifth. Here comes the first pitch. Who started him with the change and it's nothing in one. 88 on a changeup. I remember when an 88 mile an hour fastball wasn't all that bad. Man the game's changing. Behind 0 and 2 now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Half swing here, but it won't matter. It's strike three called anyway, and that's out number one. The batter. Now the pitch. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And foul, though it had the home run distance. The windup and the 0-1. Hit in the air to right field. Long run for the right fielder. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Ready for another shot now. Bryce Harper. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. High in the air out to center field. Giving chase is Nimmo. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side.
Top half of the sixth about to get started, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Brandon Nimmo. Number nine, Brandon Nimmo. Swing and a miss, and he's behind 0 1. You see that swing right there? You know what that tells me, boys? That this pitcher is doing his job right here, but also the offense is obviously not picking anything up today. Now a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. That's a great job of holding up right there. You have two strikes on you. You're trying to protect the plate. It's difficult to not get super aggressive at the plate. Nimmo with an even count of two and two now. Grounded back up the middle. Taken in by Gregorius. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. And that will bring in the former top prospect, Ahmed Rosario. He's one for two in the ballgame. A swing and a ground ball to third. And very quickly there, they're two gone to start the inning. Jeff McNeil will be the next to take a turn. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. And, ooh, I'm not sure you can get fooled worse than that. It's 0-1. Man, that's another ugly swing right there. This team is just struggling so mightily to get on base. They've looked off balance all game. Now here's a fly ball. Well hit. Racing back the right fielder. And that one is gone on a two-strike count with two away in the inning. So here's Pete Alonzo. The battle. The first baseman. As he'll send a ground ball Alonso. down to third. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Bottom of the sixth inning now, and next to bat will be the first baseman, Reese Hoskins. The first baseman, Reese. Swing and a miss on the slider, nothing in one. Hoskins behind the count, 0-2. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. Hey, that's a nice take by the batter right there, but that's a non-competitive off-speed pitch. Got to do better to at least entice a swing. Two balls and two strikes now. Trying to nibble here, and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. Got him, and he goes down on strikes for the third time. First delivery to him on the way. Hard hit ball to second. And that will find its way into right field for a one-out single. Now back, the designated hitter. Stepping in now, Luke Voigt. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. So it's a runner at first with two men out. And that'll bring in Gene Segura. As a look, now the pitch. Fouled away. Here's a fastball that crowds him a bit, and it's one and one. Lots of hits given up, but so far, no walks. At least he's making them work to get on base. Problem is, they haven't had to work too hard. The one and two pitch. A swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes. And that will retire the side. Seventh inning ready to roll. And digging in is the outfielder, Michael Conforto. Here's the first pitch to him. Conforto. A dive and he knocks it down. And he'll make it to first easily on what will almost certainly be ruled an infield single. And that'll bring up Wilson Ramos. And there's a swing and a miss at an off-speed pitch to start him out. Nothing in one. 
Hey, it's always key getting early strikes in the count. This guy's been awesome at it so far. More than 70% of his first pitches have been in the strike zone. No luck will take it himself for the first out of the inning. Next will be the designated hitter, Robinson Cano. He's bounced out and flown out in his first two plate appearances. From the stretch, here's the pitch. We're in the seventh now. Four to one, our score to this point. A ball and a strike. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Smokes this one into deep center field. Back goes Harper to the track. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Digging in once again, Yoannis Cespedes. He was sat down on strikes in his last at-bat. And that misses ball one. And it's fouled away. A runner on first with two away. And the pitch misses low and away for ball two. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. McCutcheon is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Last half of the seventh here and digging in at the plate the Texas native Nick Williams. Nick Williams. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Now a check swing, but it's strike one anyway, says the home plate umpire. Strike two as the fastball is let go. Line towards center field. Nimmo has to roam straight back, but he has it for the first out. Digging in, Scott Kingery. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. And he'll just fight this one off as it's chopped foul. The 0 1. And the slider gets him swinging. Two gone. So two are gone now in the Philadelphia seventh. And that will bring up the former National League MVP, Andrew McCutcheon. Fastball just misses. That's ball one. hit the other way out toward right field and that will conclude matters here in the seventh ready to begin the eighth and set to go as the third baseman J.D. Davis first pitch of the at bat on its way hit hard down the left field line but this will be foul. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. And no swing, apparently. Ball one. Hey, this guy's nasty on the mound. And to check swing and not chase that one puts himself right back in the count. I'll straighten him up there on that fastball. It's one and two now. Here's the pitch. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. Hey, this is a real pesky hitter right here. As a pitcher, you really like to keep this guy off the bases. This is a guy that kind of sets the tables for big innings. And a good take there will net him a base runner as it's ball four now to start the eighth inning. So a runner at first now with nobody out. And ready to bat next, the Wyoming native Brandon Nimmo. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. 
Got to believe the pitcher's going to trust his defense right here. Look for something down in his zone to induce a ground ball double play. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. Here it comes, 0-2. Drilled to the left side. That's through, and he's got his first base hit. He's one for three. The battle. Victor Arano is on the pitch here in the eighth with nobody out. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the field. At the plate now, Ahmed Rosario. As he'll swing and miss at a first pitch slider at strike one. Boy, he comes back with a beautiful pitch there, and he's dominating this at bat. It's 0-2 now. So back-to-back -back sliders for strikes. Does he come back with yet another? Hey, not normally a good plan to throw three consecutive sliders in a row. This guy's slider is so good, I think he might throw it again. Got him to go down swinging there. Ahmed Rosario becomes the first out of the inning. There's a ball into right center field. That's going to be a base hit. home but not in time as the run scores and the lead is trimmed to one at the plate Pete Alonso as he'll try to hold back on the swing but he went around for the first strike there's a ball into right center field that's going to be a base hit in at second safely as this game is tied late with a run scoring away from the play in now Michael Conforto as the first pitch to him runs a bit inside for ball one he's working on a one for three thus far fouled off it's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse little chopper back to the mound and there's out number two Here's the catcher Wilson Ramos runner in scoring position with Sugan. First pitch of the at bat. And that swung on and missed for strike one. Hey from a pitcher standpoint sometimes the greatest pitch is the slider that backs up. He got away with that one but he wants that thing to bury down the way. One ball one strike to count. The one one. A ball and two strikes now. I'm interested to watch this next pitch right here. He got a swing on a high fastball. I wonder if he's going to pull the old flea sack and climb the ladder. Now a line drive to left center field, and it's going to get down for a base hit. Coming in to score easily is the runner from third, and they've taken the lead here in the eighth. Now over to first, and he's safe getting back. As a run is also in, and with it, they take the lead. Here's Robbie Cano now. As he'll swing and send a chopper out to second. He's got it. On to first, and it's in time as they're finally able to retire him. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. And next will be the power-hitting catcher, JT Realmuto. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. The wind up and the 0 1. Swing and a miss on the slider, and he's quickly behind nothing and two. Welcome to my world, right here, batter. I've seen this 0 2 count way too many times. Hittable pitch in the middle of the zone, you take one. Slider in the dirt, you come unglued. Now you got to step out of the box, you have no idea what's going to happen. And he'll get in at second base as the tying runs aboard with a leadoff double. Up next for Philadelphia. The center fielder. Right. Here's Bryce Harper now. As he'll look at a fastball too high for ball one. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. That's wide 2-0. Oh. Well, this is a spot you'd like to be in. 2-0, oh, good hitter. He's going to turn it loose right here. As a look, now the pitch. And he is in there at third as the possible tying run. The runner in scoring position with none out. Three and one. Down to three and one. A 
There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. A ball that's carrying. But he can't get to this one. It's off the wall. And the tying run is in to score from third. It's now a 5-5 ball game. Dylan Batensis is on to pitch here in the eighth with nobody out. And that'll bring up the Sacramento product, Reese Hoskins. And he fouls this one off. From the belt, the pitch. The ball on two strikes. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first and no swing. It's ball two. Go ahead runs in scoring position here with nobody out. Fouled away. This one sinks low and a touch outside. It's a full count three and two. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters. So you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. The next 3 2. Now here's a check swing, and they appeal down to first. No swing. So that's ball four. So now to the plate, Didi Gregorius. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. First delivery to him on the way. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that nearly broke our tie, but instead it's a foul ball. A swing and a high drive to right center field. Center fielder going back. And they have taken the lead. Into the box now, Luke Voigt. As the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. With this one almost in the books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this? Swung on and hit deep to left center. Gone! Back to back homers. Gene Segura standing in as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. He struggled a bit coming out of the bullpen here, so he needed that strike. Maybe it settles him down a little bit. Pace is empty here with nobody out. Two balls and a strike. Somebody's getting frustrated. He's not used to getting hit around like this. Philly shortstop in front in the count three and one. Hey, this is one of those tough outings as a reliever. Just have to keep throwing strikes and believe sooner or later this inning is going to turn around. Count full, three balls and two strikes. Too high, and that cost him ball four. Stepping into the box, Nick Williams. Hit the ball pretty well in his last at bat, but it resulted in a line out. Jerry Spamilia takes the ball here as he'll enter with a runner at first and nobody out. From the belt, kicks and deals. Strike one to start the at bat. And it's fouled away. Nobody out, runner on first. Good waste pitch, one and two. Familia primarily attacks hitters with a sinker, but not your typical sinker. He throws it much harder than most. He's a hard guy to get elevation on. In a day and age where a lot of hitters are looking to lift and separate and get the ball in the air, he has some good sink, not great sink, but he makes hitters hit the ball on the ground. And when he's on, you'll see a lot of ground balls. Well, he punched out. Meanwhile here, this ball's given a pretty good ride out to deep left field, and that is going to clear the wall. A home run. To the plate now, Andrew McCutcheon. Well, As the sinker to him finds the zone for strike one. 
He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. One and one to Andrew McCutcheon. Now the one and one pitch. Hit to third. And there are two away now. Digging in and looking for more, JT Real Muto has doubled and singled in four at bats in this contest. And that's in there for strike one. Outside for a ball, one and one. One and two now as this catches the outer half. Seven runs have crossed the plate in the inning. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first and no swing. It's ball two. Line drive to center field. Nimmo is there to make the catch and mercifully. David Robertson comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Stepping in, Joannis Cespedes. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Out in front of it, strike one. The 0-1 on its way. Hit on the ground out to short. There's Segura. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. J.D. Davis the next to bat. No hits to this point. First pitch coming. Here it is. Skied into straightaway right. Williams is under it. And that's the second out of the inning. Now to the plate. Brandon Nimmo. He singled his last time up. Pitch on the way. Tried to check it and it's 0-1. Hit back up the middle. Segura to his left. He's there. Throw on to first.